lot of steps to complete their 7,000 mile journey. And their final stop right here in San Diego, and it's all to raise money for veteran families. Hello, beautiful people. Hello. Hi. Okay, my gosh. Now, the, the people of Drum Hike and Soldiers Angels are here to tell us more about their mission and what it, what, introduce yourselves, everyone. Let's just start here. I'm Rebecca Yoakum, um, Troy's wife. My name is Troy Yoakum. Uh, we just now completed 3,400 miles of walking across America to raise funds for struggling military families. Oh, that is that is fantastic. I want to talk to you guys more about that in just a second. So mm -hmm. introduce yourselves, guys. Hi, please. I'm Susan Lawson with Soldiers Angels Volunteer for San Diego. And you are you are making this happen. Yes, ma'am? Troy's making it happen. I am his grunt. Okay. <laughs> and sir, what is your name? Chris Vidali. I'm a veteran, and this is my family. Hello, Chris and family. Thank you all for being here. And also, um, the, the, the women that we're looking at here now the, are the, um, the pin-up girls? Pin-up patriots. Pin-up patriots. Hello, pin-up patriots. Okay. All right. So let's get back. You guys did what? You walked how long? 3,404 miles all the way to San Diego to uh, raise funds for struggling military families. Now, where did you start? Well, we started in Louisville, Kentucky, and didn't really take too straight of a route. We headed north first to Chicago and kind of zigzagged across America to larger okay. cities uh, to raise awareness and funds. So what did you do as, as you, uh, here we have some pictures. Did you stop in and talk to radio stations and TV stations? A all? lot of media through, uh, through our journey. Mm -hmm. um, you know, so many people that we've met that are in need. It amazes me how many people approach us each and every single day that can't pay their bills and, you know, just don't have jobs and things like that. And we started this hike to help as many people as possible. Okay, now are you guys active military? Are you veterans? He was army. Yes. I'm okay. just a military spouse. Uh, just a military <laughs> just spouse? A military what? Spouse. <laughs> it, is a, it is a group effort, as I'm sure you are well aware. So what inspired you to do this then? My good friend, uh, he was struggling pretty badly. He was an Iraq war veteran, lost his job, had to sell his house, file bankruptcy. And that's when I contacted charities. I was in Iraq at the time and you know, I just found out this, this enormous amount of people were applying for financial assistance in the same year that we've also had the highest rate of suicides among veterans. And I thought this is not a coincidence. You know, somebody has to step up to do something. So your message is when you're stopping into all the different, um, you know, events along the way, what is your and by, by the way, your dog was with you too, right? The dog's yes. not feeling well today, but the dog did the trip as well. What is your message? What is it that you want people to come away with on this Veterans Day? You know, Every single person in America can play a little part in helping. It's as easy as donating, you know, $5, and I think that's something that everyone can afford. Um, you know, my goal is to raise $5 million, and here we are. We're closing in on halfway across America and back. We're actually going to head all the way back across America after Veterans Day. Okay. Um, <laughs> and keep on raising funds and keep on helping more people. Chris, what does this mean to you? Oh, this means a lot. And I mean, you're being awarded $2,500? Definitely. I mean, you know, it's, we've been struggling for quite a while since I've been out of the military, and what Troy's doing is absolutely awesome. I mean, he's helping the veterans out there because, you know, opportunities have just kind of dried up. And, and what branch of the military? I was U.S. Army. And where did you travel overseas? Yes, I did. Where did you go? Um, I went to Iraq. You went to Iraq? Yes. And now the transition from being in the military into the civilian world and having been in combat, having now you're back in what, California. Yep. It's not as easy. You People can't even imagine how, how, how hard it is. It's, it's much more difficult. Like, I mean, yes, they brief you and they tell you that adjustment is going to be easy but it, or difficult, but it was extremely difficult. It, is, it still is every day. You know, there's... there's um, I've been told that there's a saying is you don't know what you don't know and there's a term called like unconscious ignorance It's like you can't even imagine how hard something is for someone when it's so far out of your realm of any kind of normalcy something like this has been uh, this is a this is a help for you yeah oh yes definitely this is a huge help for what are you me. gonna do what are you gonna do with it do you think um pay bills pay bills yeah <laughs> yes. well um Thank you all for being here. You're going to be in the parade on Pacific that we were just talking As about. As celebrity grand marshal today. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. <laughs> hey, kids, are you guys going to be in the parade? Are you guys going to be in the parade today? Yes. Yay. <laughs> By the way, hi, ladies. Hi. Hello. Okay, you guys are going to be in the parade too, right? Yes. Okay, great. And then as soon as, as soon as we're finished with the parade, we're walking all the way to the Veterans Museum, and we're helping four more families today. That's fantastic. Thank you all for your service.
ma'am, for facilitating this. Yeah. And for you and your family, I wish you guys the best. Please keep us posted on this Veterans Day. This is a uh, quite an honorable story to be able to tell here on the Fox 5 Morning News. Thank you all very much. There's the check. You can also party with them at uh, Balboa Park, right? And the, at, at From a party. 2 to 5 p.m. at the Veterans Museum. Okay. Come and watch us hang up. Yes, great. Thank you guys very much for being here. Uh, for more information, go to fox5sandiego.com and click on the scene on button. Again, thank you all. Thank you from the bottom of my heart for all that you all are doing. Guys, back to you down in the studio. Okay, Chrissy, thank you very much. Great.